Hey everybody, welcome back to the YouTube channel, Living the Country Life with Thomas Collins. Today we're here at the house, and today is the day we're going to go through the fire truck, look through the bins, look at the cab, look at some old paperwork, whatever's in there. I want to thank each and every one of y'all for subscribing, liking, commenting. Thank you very much. It really means a lot to me. Alright, let's get to this. And as you see, the fire truck was behind me. It is a really beautiful fire truck. I'm debating if I should go to the print shop and just get some letters. Um, printed out for this year. And get the otter, get the otter printed out, get the volunteer fire department, um, get the 271 stickers. Or should I paint it on? Right now it's painted. This all needs to be sanded down. Just this door here. I'm not sure what to do. So help me out there. Or what do you think I should do? I mean... A lot of y'all said this is where the axe goes from here and the handle fits in there. Yeah, there's a step. Not sure this is for some kind of oil. Probably for the pump in there. A lot of this stuff is like frozen. It won't move. It says turn to unlock. Oh, so... It needs a lot of work. Y'all said these were hose clamps, which I figured that out. So here's the first one. Let's see what's in here. Some crime tape. Fire hydrant turner on. Nozzle. Another place for an axe. Pretty cool. Big old tires. Ladder. There's a nozzle in here. Some things probably wasn't cheap back in the day. I'm going to pull this tarp off of here today and show y'all under it and show y'all the rust. That might be what you hook to the hose and put in a pond or something. Not sure. I'm not, a, I'm not a fire person, so I'm not sure what this stuff is. I know it's all hooks to the hoses and fire hydrants and stuff, so. Maybe y'all can help me in the comments. It's a 1965 Ford. F750. I think it's an international, but I'm not sure. These are some kind of pry bars here. Pretty cool. The rail is up there. I got to get some big batteries for it. 
See, one of these moved. It might have been. They're hard to move. I know it's old. Just not sure. All right, y'all ready for the inside? Look how easy these doors shut. Just normal shutting. Like, blows my mind. So easy. This window is cracked, as you see. It's sad about that. Oops. Oh, tags. Sirens. Clutch. Brakes. I gotta get the brakes fixed. Got some stuff down here. Drill bit. Looks like a fire suit. We're gonna go through all this and clean it up. Let's look at this paperwork. Check it out. Say emergency response. There's all kind of stuff in here. Job aid. Pretty cool. Looks like the insurance. Pretty cool. Some other guide here. throwing away none of the stuff in the totes. I'm just going through this. I'm seeing what some of this is. Vaseline. I don't want no Vaseline. This is an air vent. And it's broke, so we have to we we'll have to replace that. Drill bit. Oh, pep towel. All right, we're gonna have to go to the other side. Over here to the other side. I'm not sure what that is. I'll keep that for now. Some old Tropicana pink lemonade. Ooh, not so pink anymore. stuff got some stuff over here let's see what that is cut oh, nothing else down there trash here definitely gonna keep these insurance I'm not sure what these are vehicle accident report we'll keep them look look at them might put them in the the book not sure what that is like a breather Overalls or suspenders, I mean. Oh, check it out! A little cubby hole. Let's see what's under here. A flashlight. We'll grab that. Some water bottle. Good old flashlight they used back in the day. All right, let's check this out. No right on any of it. All right. Now 
Now, I need to get my blower and I can blow some of this dust out of here. What do y'all think about it? I'm not sure what to do with this yet. It's, as you see, it's all broke there. One screw's holding it there. And one down there. And it's just particle board. I think I'm gonna take it down. I have to find me another piece to put there or find the whole new roof panel. As you see, it ain't there, so. Alrighty, I'm gonna get to cleaning this out a little better. Leave in the comments what y'all think about it. I think it's awesome. I've been getting so many messages from people about it. The history from Archer and how Otter Creek got it. And just all sorts of things. Can't get back to everybody. So I'm sorry about that. But you know what I'm going to look. Let's look in the ashtray. And look in the glove compartment. We ain't done that yet. Yeah, what do y'all think's an ashtray? Cigarette butts or receipts or change or all three or nothing? We'll look in there in a minute. Let's look in here. Uh oh. There's this, the sun to that other flashlight. Daddy's over there. Here's the sun. And here's another one of these. Insurance. Pretty cool. Back door. Plug in. Some tools, chain. pretty cool man definitely 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 different mm, what is for some stuff over here alright well get my blower and Get everything over here so I can blow this thing out. Check it out, everybody. This old truck got wing windows. It has the air vents down here. That's so cool. Got one over there. Alright. Y'all ready to see? Y'all seen what was in here? Let's look in here. I'll be go to heck. I don't know if y'all can see cigarette butts. It's crazy. Them suckers gotta be old. It looks like Marlboro. Wow. Old cigarette butts. Finding more stuff. Found an old Marlboro box. Trash, it was back up here in this little cubby hole back there. More paper towels and another water bottle. I gotta put that stuff up. That was all behind the seat. So, look at these old split rams. Some things are some dangerous things, people say. They say it's all about how you do it and if you do it the right way, it ain't dangerous. If you be sloppy with it, they say it can be dangerous. All right, everybody, got the generator going with the blower. Fixing to blow these leaves out. Already blew this out. Cleaning it up a little bit. I'm fixing to get this tarp off of here. And then I'm gonna blow this out over here. So let's get to it. This tarp must be full of water. 
I can't even pull it off from the back. So I'm gonna get my tripod so y'all can watch me get it off. I'm gonna have to get up here on top of the fire truck and pull this tarp off of here. So let me get my tripod and we'll go from there. All right, let me get up there and see what I can do. Gonna try to figure out. Let me see if there's any steps back here. Okay, let me set y'all up in position. All right, let me do this. tiring that tarp was heavy you'll see all the water dripping that thing was so full of water i'm gonna spread it out this tarp ain't no good here it's pretty rotted this one over here is about rotted but it's better than nothing Got that laid out to dry. I'll show you all the results here on the fire truck. Here in a minute. Let me uh, finish doing what I'm doing and I'll show y'all. All right, everybody. I got the tarp down, laid out as you've seen. Found some more goodies. I haven't seen this stuff yet. It looks like some kind of clamp and some ramp, some tire book chocks. Let's see what's in here. <laughs> <clears throat> more tire chocks heck yeah uh oh fire helmet well I got a pair of fire pants a helmet now and some suspenders Heck 
Heck yeah. I don't say no name on it. Right here. Cool. But I just want to show y'all what these hoses are doing. I know some of y'all are going to get mad when I take them off and get rid of these hoses. They're no good. They're dry rotted. Look what it's doing. It is rotting it away. So, that tarp and all the, over the years, it's been in the weather for about four years. This is from when I, all these hoses are no good. They have to be thrown out or maybe give them to somebody that can use them on a farm. I mean, they're good for light pressure, but I don't think I would trust them for heavy pressure going through them. I don't know if y'all can see up here too good. It's real bright the sun. Yeah, there's another fire hydrant turner on. Anyways, leave in the comments some ideas what you would do. I uh, blowed all the leaves off here. Cleaned the inside out. Let me show y'all. Look at the puddle of water that was up there and stuff. Our next video on the fire truck is going to be me pressure washing it. It's all blowed out. It ain't swept out, but it's all blowed out. Looks a lot better, cleaned out. I ain't messed with nothing or took anything out yet. Got the old um, fire engine 81 is what that says. I still haven't put a battery in it. That's going to be another video. Right now, I was just cleaning it up. Cleaning it up, seeing what I need, what needs to be done, and going from there. Leave me some ideas. Like I was saying, you know, any, any ideas will help. You know, I'm not going to be able to do this fast. It takes time and money. But it's paid for. It belongs to us. And I appreciate your help. If it wasn't for y'all, I wouldn't have it. I appreciate y'all watching, liking, and subscribing. Thank you. I just, I just think it's so cool. I can't wait to drive it to the town meetings in the Otter Creek Parade. Drive it to town. Go get my groceries and go pay the light bill in it. You know, that'd be so cool. And that's my plans. The good Lord's willing. I just don't know what I should do. If I should take all the fire engine pumps off. You know, maybe leave the reel up there and leave some of the stuff. And put some seats up there for the parade. Leave all the cab and the sirens up there on it. Just take maybe the big pump and stuff off. You know, leave all these gauges here, but make it make it look like a fire truck, but it's gutted on the inside. I don't know. Because definitely it would take a lots and lots and lots of money to get all this stuff operating here. I would love to keep it original, but I want to use it. I want to I want to get some use out of it. And the only way I'm going to get use out of it is if I make it like a parade truck. Yeah, I can keep all this on here, but all that's just extra weight. It's no good. It all it would have to be replaced anyways with new stuff or rebuild this if it's possible to rebuild it. I don't know. I'm going to show you all the engine. You all have seen it. It's all cleaned out nice and pretty. Got the tarp off. Alright, and this hose is just here. I don't know why, but I'm going to get it out of here. Put it on the passenger side. I want to show you all the engine door just closes immaculate check it out 
pretty cool. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Please subscribe. We'll see you on the next one.